Hi, I'm Alec Heist. I'm the drummer for Avondale, and I am a social studies teacher at Craigmont High School. Avondale is actually a band that we started in college at the University of Illinois that we've now brought to Memphis, have toured around the Midwest and the Mid-South, and have been lucky enough to record at places like Art and Studios here in Memphis while being teachers. I fell in love with history when I was pretty little and social studies. And so when I was at University of Illinois, I got into the secondary education program. I was exposed to things that I hadn't really thought about, like educational inequity. And then when I got into Teach for America, I thought it was an opportunity that I didn't really want to pass up. And the guys were so cool about, instead of going to any other city, they were like, hey man, Memphis is a music town. Let's go there. I didn't really know anything about it. And like besides like blues and barbecue, that's literally all I knew. The more and more as I learned, I was like, wait, this is, would be a really good fit. What's at the core and what like the way people are. I never feel like anyone's not being themselves. Before we moved here, and before we had really made the decision to come, we'd have a tradition before shows and we still do it just to get their vocals warmed up and I'll just clap my hands and we do sitting on the dock of the bay. So then to come so f far away and make this home and have that song have all that meaning. Otis Redding being on Stax Records and it's been kind of a cool like, hey, we're in these studios and involved with these people that work with guys like that. And now our lead guitarist works at Rise Academy in Raleigh as well. The old guitarist in the band was at Kip. So it's been this weird, educators by day, musicians by night. I think like Ardent and even my school with the students, it's almost like a microcosm of the way people treat you in the city. Here I am, never really been in an environment like this or like this, whether it was at the school or the studio. Because again, I was like some punk kid out of college who thought he could play the drums and you get in that studio, and you don't know what you're doing. And it can feel the same way in the classroom, but I've always felt like I belong.